Hi, I'm Artifacts of Mars, and President Trump has done the right thing by pardoning Sheriff Joe Arpaio. And the usual suspects are out in force, of course, uh, slamming the president for doing this. Too bad. So, let's go over this briefly. I'm not going to spend a lot of time on this. Arizona Senator John McCain said Trump's pardon of Arpaio undermined the president's claim for the respect rule of law. You, Senator McCain, are a demented old man. Sorry. That's exactly what you are. Demented, twisted, and old. And can't do anything about the old part, but uh, the demented part we could because you should be thrown out of office. Representative Mark Pocan. Outrageous and quick, completely unacceptable. Get bent. Donald Trump just embraced white supremacy in an entirely new level. Catherine Clark, what a disgrace. No, madam, you are a disgrace. Sally Yates, he got canned by Trump. And his pardon pen post reveals his own contempt for a constitution or courts and founding prison principles of equality and justice. And McCain ones I already read. Pardon of Joel Arpaio, the illegally profiled Latinos on them. Undermine his claim for the respect to rule of law. Jeff Flake, aptly named because he's a flaky individual, echoed what McCain said. During the Arpaio pardon, I would have preferred the president honor the judicial process. Let it take its course. Yeah, the judicial process by corrupt judges, uh, Mr. Flaky, is dishonoring an honorable man, namely Sheriff Joe. Meanwhile, Arizona's Governor Doug Ducey and Congressman Andy Biggs are supporting the President's pardon. Good. Ducey said in a statement that Arpaio deserves credit helping reduce crime in Maricopa County over his long career in law enforcement and public office. Now this was strictly a uh, political conviction. They had nothing to do with crime. Here's a story briefly. Uh, the judge found him Susan Bolton, corrupt judge. And here's another article it's from Newsmax. Uh, so it's politics, which this uh, was. This was purely political. It had nothing to do with law enforcement. It just infuriates me that this can go on in this country. This is third world status, folks. These judges are corrupt third world judges. Uh, that do this type of thing. Sheriff Joe is one of the most honorable men this country has seen in a long time. And these people that did this to him are dishonorable. And they don't deserve to call themselves Americans. I'm not taking it! I'm not taking that back! They don't deserve to call themselves Americans! I'm tired of this! Well, anyway, there you go. Uh, good job, President Trump. 